What's up? It's your boy, Denez Jones, a.k.a. The Grip, and you're watching Raw Talent Sports. Track and field has always been the most dominant sport in the Bahamas, and basketball has always been popular. In recent years, though, the sport of American football is becoming more appealing to young Bahamian men. The Caribbean American Football League, otherwise known as the CAFL, has been an outlet for more than 20 years, and Ed Smith opened the doors to the NFL by becoming the first Bahamian player back in the 1970s. Almost 30 years later in 2003, DeVard Darling became just the second Bahamian to be drafted into the NFL. Then in 2005, Smith's son Alex Smith became the third Bahamian-blooded NFL player. And in this episode of Raw Talent Sports, we'll be showing you a batch of young Bahamian athletes, some of whom are destined to become a pro athlete. Fortunately for us, former Bahamian Olympiad Frank Rutherford was hosting a national youth combine down at Goodman's Bay and was scouting for talent to filter into the United States, primarily in the sports of American football and basketball. The man behind all of this, the combine, Frank Rutherford, who uh, sponsored by Mega Malt, which is uh, Frank's brand. I mean, so. pretty much, um, are you happy with, pleased with what you're seeing out here today? Yeah, this, this is a good start for the first year. And it's a preload to divide football camp in April when we're going to have more college coaches. And then we also will have a good grip on the amount of talent we have here as well as what we will add to it. Um, so to get something started like this, I feel will snowball in the future years and people will understand how serious and the impact and understand what a combine is. Okay, so yes, I'm, I'm, I'm pretty pleased. I, I was looking you know, for the kind of number, 60 to 100 and something kids. So, it's pretty good stuff. All right, thanks, man. And for motivational and inspirational purposes, DeVar Darling, on a break from the NFL's Baltimore Ravens, came home for a little R&R &R and decided to come out to his cousin Frank's youth combine to lend a helping hand. With me now, we have uh, DeVar Darling, NFL player, wide receiver with the uh, Baltimore Ravens home in the Bahamas helping Frank Rutherford at this very first uh, Mega Mall Combine, National Combine, looking for talent here in the Bahamas. Devon, uh, Devard, welcome back home. And uh, you know, you're home here taking part in this uh, in this Combine. What have you seen so far and what do you think about the idea? Well, um, the idea is, is, is very well, you know, in, in, in the aspect of, of just bringing out talent, bringing out young people out here, trying to, you know, see what they have and, and see what they can do. So, I mean, there's a lot of talent out here, and uh, that's what we're just looking for, someone to, to, to put up in, into Frank's program and, and to excel on in life. And, uh, you know, looking at some of the kids that you've seen today, um, anything in particular stands out, height, weight, size, uh, you know, quickness? Yeah, they got some big kids out here, man. We got a lot of big kids out here with some, some, some talent, you know? You can see some raw talent in them. Like, uh, I don't know if you can show, but a young guy over there, I, I don't know his name right now, but he's a big, young talent right now, you know? I think you're talking about uh, Maurice Conyers. Uh, this is, he's a guy, one of the guys who caught a flight from Iron, just ran the plane down, knocked on the oh. door. So he gave us a story, yeah. But uh, we, we're going to look for some more stories for that. But uh, we wanted to talk about you, my Ravens. You, you like playing with that team in that city? I mean, uh, Baltimore is a great city, man. It's a, it's a great atmosphere whenever uh, at MNT Bank uh, we playing on Sundays. And, uh, man, it's a, it's a great city. 280, and you can run a 4-6. Got good grades. You can tackle, you can do everything. Yeah, I think you're gonna play big time football somewhere. If you're a little guy, a wide receiver, or, or, or somewhere between the, 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 the weight of 160 to 100 to 215 pounds, and you can run a 4-3, I think you'll play in the NFL like Devon. All right? Speed is everything in football, sir. Speed and technique and heart, competitiveness, and I ain't gonna lose to nobody. That's what we getting ready to do here. I wanna see if you guys got that inside you. 